On the 30th November 2021, UPDF launched strikes against ADF rebels hideouts in a joint operation with the Democratic Republic of Congo Army. This was followed by deployment of troops on the Congolese side of the border. A few hours after strikes of the joint military operations, UPDF immediately deployed troops and military equipment crossed Nobel border point in North Kivu province. It followed the ground forces when they crossed Bubandi Nobil border point, uh, which entered into the Democratic Republic of Congo up to a place called Mokakati where the forces uh, established the forward operating base. Uh, the stopover at Mukakati uh, was because of uh, the poor roads. The poor road uh, from Mukakati up to River Samuliki Bridge was uh, so bad that it could not uh, allow a combined force of UPDF elements drawn from infantry, motorized brigade, armored, and special forces command moved into Eastern Congo. Another base uh, which would uh, allow the ground forces to spring into the, the Virunga forest, into the Virunga impenetrable forest. So the forces moved, the joint forces, that is the, the combined uh, FRDC. Uh, the armies of Congo and Uganda, UPDF, entered into uh, the Virunga forest to the, to the first objective, that is uh, Kambi Yayua. At the front line against armed forces in northeastern Democratic Republic of Congo, Major General Kanja Muhanga's determination is to destroy once and for all the rebels of the allied Democratic forces, ADF. Wherever you will be, we shall reach everywhere the enemy will be. Not that uh, this operation is going to continue. We shall overrun every ADF camp in Eastern DRC. We shall reach everywhere they are. On foot, we shall reach. Now, UPDF have settled in the middle of the forest in Eastern Congo, not troubled by any ADF attacks. Shuja operation mission's priority is to eradicate ADF rebels and allow the return of the lasting peace and commercial activities in the northeastern part of Congo. Water uh, do not have uh, any water, uh, water points, so we had to open up water points. Uh, the road was uh, to be constructed that will enable trade uh, between uh, from uh, Nobil water point or Bundibujo up to up to Beni. Ground troops have continued their operations to pursue the ADF through think idols areas that have been under threat for decades. UPDF and Congo Army currently doing their best within the framework of the memorandum to end the sufferings of civilians from both countries from the violences inflicted by ADF. UPDF and Congolese Army commanders meet regularly to review the operation and ascertain the way forward against the enemy. But many questions have been raised by political actors in the region against the deployment of UPDF forces in the Democratic Republic of Congo. Mutesa Sida Haruna, UBC News.